Welcome back to the Roadshow this morning in the Buzz. Memorial Day weekend usually means parades, events to honor our fallen heroes, of course, um, and maybe some family cookouts as well. Yeah, but if there are some bargain hunters out there, it also means it's time to save. That's right. All the big box stores are offering sales this weekend, so it's got us to thinking about sales in general. Yeah, do you wait for certain times of the year mm -hmm. or holiday weekends right. to save, or do you just buy whenever you feel like it? I I like a good sale. Like, I like something yeah, when it comes out of sale. Yeah, you can't deal. deny a good deal. You can't deny a good deal. Like, when you see something, and, and you can't wait either because they go quick, depending yes. on what it is. But when I want something, I do just buy it. But I obsess about it. Mm -hmm. I obsess about what I'm going to buy. And you research, research, I do. research. I do, yes. I do. Like, I'll look at something, and then I, then I convince myself not to get it. Yep. Then I convince myself, well, why shouldn't I get it? And then I'm back to, oh, but where are, are you really going to use it? But, and I'm back and forth. I usually end up... You end up getting I it. I end up getting it in the, in the end. And then, you know, there are some times where I've had buyers regret afterwards. Mm. Like, oh, I probably shouldn't have spent the money on that. And what am I going to do with this? You know? I, I'm torn by this because I love a good sale. And sure. a lot of times I'm a cheapskate and I'll have the apps and everything and scan. And, like, right. maybe something's discounted. And I don't know it until, yeah. you know, you get in the store. But I also find that if you run out of something, like, for me, sometimes even in terms of like like daily maintenance, like if it's a mascara and I'm like, I'm out of mascara, right. I like a certain brand, I like this one, is it on sale? No, but I need it right now, so yes, right. I'm getting that, I'm getting the items that, that I need. Now, if it's something that I can wait on, maybe if it's a bigger purchase, sure. yeah, and then I think, hey, is anything coming up? Is it a holiday, you know, Black Friday? Is right. it an Amazon Prime Day? Is it a long weekend, yeah. like this one coming up? And I'll say, I can wait and maybe save fifty, hundred dollars. Sometimes you never know, or just see maybe it'll go on sale. And if by then it still doesn't, okay, I'll, yeah, then you, I'll then still you get, purchase yeah, yeah. it. Yeah. I think as you said, and as you put so eloquently put it, daily maintenance. <laughs> yes, I, daily maintenance. Daily maintenance. I think. I think. Look, I think if you want something for daily maintenance, I yeah. think just get it. Because <laughs> I think. I think that's right. one of those. If you're out of said item, you just, yeah, stop Daily up. maintenance items, I think, are probably <laughs> off the thing and, you know, are probably good. Expensive stuff because, as you know. You get what you pay for. Well, you get what you pay for, right? You, you, like, you can buy junk. Yep. And if you get junk, then you're buying it five times. And I happen to have, uh, like, ex expensive taste. Like, when I want something, not expensive taste, but I mean, no, no, and I don't mean it that way. But, like, I like, I like things that... No, I know, that work, work well, right. or that last exactly. longer. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. And cost a lot. You know what I am about that? With, like, um, conditioner. For me, like, VO5 and Suave is junk. It's water in a can for me. It does nothing. Okay. So I will buy a pricier shampoo or conditioner. For daily maintenance. To, for daily maintenance. <laughs> for daily maintenance. That actually does something. That way I don't go through half a bottle in one shower, Brendan. Right. And I'm sure you, exactly. you've come across this too, different products and things that you're like, oh, this was a dollar for a reason. Right, right. for my general body maintenance, yeah. of course. <laughs> like, daily, daily, maintenance. Maintenance. daily maintenance. Daily maintenance. Daily yeah. maintenance. Yeah, I mean, there's just so, uh, well, you know me. I've been watching. a lot. <laughs> yes, yes. I've been wanting to update my monocle collection, yes, and yes. I, I'm waiting for one to go on sale. Uh, but it's just one of those things where, yeah, like if you need the thing, like you said, Michaela, it's like, well, I'd like to wait till it goes on sale, but I really do need it, so it's like a, a, it's an expense that's a necessity. Right. Yeah. Is right. It, what's the last crazy thing you went and bought? Probably sneakers, right? Uh. I do have my eye on a rather expensive guitar. I've told okay. you about oh. this. Right. I haven't purchased it yet, but that's probably, I've kind of been working toward that because I really haven't purchased anything big for myself because I've been paying off some things that okay. need to be paid off. Right. Oh, there you go. Yeah, so exactly. treat yourself. He deserves it. Well, no, he Will, deserves it. Will has been encouraging the guitar purchase <laughs> since like last fall. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, you know, then I can rock out with Metallica. Right. There you go. And it'll be the greatest thing ever. Well, let's check in with our viewers out there to see what you guys have to say about this. This topic when it comes to spending and that stuff it's always an interesting one to see how people you know conduct themselves when it comes to this because it can be a challenge do I spend do I not spend Heather's up first if I need or want something I always look and see where the best deal is if it's something I can afford I buy it otherwise I just wait till I have the money 
James is up next saying I did buy a futon so I would have something to sleep on and I did wait for those jeans to go on sale so that I could afford to buy myself a few pairs. Waiting for that sale was tough though. Yes, yeah, sometimes it's like, all right, when's it going on sale? And finally, Greg adds, when I want something, you, I usually just go to the mall and nine times out of 10 stumble into a deal. Yeah, that's the best when you just walk into something great. Thanks very much, Greg. And thanks to everyone for commenting today. You know what to do. What is this right here? Uh, follow us at The Road Show on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And you never know, we may leave <laughs> if you leave a comment, we might read it right here on the show.